Hi guys, it's Miss Strawberry here and today I'm going to talk to you guys about the importance of recycling and the different types of recycling. So, the things that you recycle are things such as glass, plastic, paper, cardboard, anything that is not food pretty much can be recycled. So, the importance of recycling things is because it can affect our atmosphere. We as human beings are not the only ones who live here on the earth. We share this earth with other living creatures. We share this earth with everything from animals that swim in the ocean, to the birds that fly in the sky, to the four-legged creatures that walk in the forest and in the jungle. We are not the only people on this earth. So we have to be mindful of how we are affecting other creatures' ability to live. And we also have to be careful because this earth that we live on can be destroyed if we do not take good care of it. We can mess up the climate. We can cause global warming to happen faster. So it's just very important to recycle. I'm actually going to talk to you today about recycling clothes. Now you're probably looking and you're going clothes. Yes, clothes. You don't always have to get rid of your clothes. You can give them to a donation center, such as the Goodwill or the U.S. Army Salvation Center. Or you can take something old and recreate it and make something new. So today I'm going to show you guys just a few of my own recycled items or my own clothing that I got that people recycled and gave to donation centers. And you will never, ever be able to tell that it was recycled because I created it into something that not only represented me, but I created it into art. So people look at it and they're always like, oh my goodness, I love these things or that's so cool, that's so creative. So I'm just gonna show you guys a few of my clothing items that I have recycled and made into something brand new. So I can't wait to show you guys. So let's get started. Okay guys, this is my first piece of clothing that is a recycled piece of clothing. I didn't create this. I actually got this from the Goodwill. It's a plaid cardigan, like a plaid sweater cardigan. So if I turn around and show you, it is very warm and it's very comfortable. So when I'm cold in the house, I will wear this sometimes if I don't want to get under a blanket but I wear this a lot in the fall and I get so many compliments on it. People love this cardigan. And so this is one of my favorite recycled pieces and guess how much I spent on this guy? $5, $5, that's it. There is no shame in going to a donation center to get clothing because you can always find very cute pieces. So this is one of the recycled clothing pieces that I have it's probably one of my favorites. So my second piece of recycled clothing are these Crocs that I painted. I actually had these Crocs and they were black and I was painting art murals for the Boys and Girls Club and some paint dropped on my shoes. And instead of tossing them, I decided, well, why not splatter some paint on them? Because I do like to paint and I am an artsy person. So I created a new look on Crocs and I get so many compliments on these Crocs. People are always asking me, where did you buy these Crocs from? Oh my goodness, that is so cute. Where can I get these Crocs? But in fact, I created them. So I'm gonna move up a little closer just to show you guys. These are my Crocs. People love these Crocs. And all I did was just take um, a small paintbrush and I dipped it in paint and I didn't let the paint drip until the, it wasn't dripping anymore. Instead of letting it drip in the paint, I let it drip over my shoes and I just moved my hands back and forth. Kind of just let it be abstract all around. And you keep, you just keep doing that to your liking. So whenever you feel satisfied with how the look comes out, then that's when you can stop. So you can cover the entire shoe with paint or you can do bits and pieces here and there. This is one of my pieces that people love and instead of throwing it away, I recycled it created it into a new art piece and I absolutely love it. It fits me, it fits my fashion, so I thought this was neat. So this is another thing you could do. Instead of throwing your shoes away, 
you can create something new out of your shoes if they aren't too damaged. So this is my last recycled pair of clothing that I'm gonna show you guys. These are my jeans. They have paint everywhere on them, front and back. So I just wear these to paint. You probably can't see it that well, so I'm moving closer. They just got paint everywhere on them. And they're actually really cute. So sometimes I'll wear these as an actual clothing piece, but nine times out of 10, I will wear them just to paint. And the same thing happened with these pants that happened with my Crocs. I was wearing these pants when I painted and I accidentally wiped my hands on my legs forgetting I had paint on my hands. And instead of throwing them away, me and a friend, as you guys may know her, Miss Samira, we just splattered paint everywhere. Now, the only thing about this is because it's like acrylic paint, it can come off sometimes if it's not a thick enough coat or a deep enough stain. So a few of the spots have come off, but it is okay because a lot of it has stayed on as well. Or it may peel, but like leave a faded look, um, faded paint look underneath it. So it's just, it's really cute if you watch it enough times. But this is just another recycled piece of clothing that I absolutely love and I just wanted to really show you guys that you don't have to throw away your clothes you can recycle them you can give them to donation centers because what you won't use someone else can see something very bright in it but you guys are so creative so I know that you guys can create amazing things out of your recycled clothing so these are just a few ideas a few things that I just wanted to show you guys and I hope you enjoyed. I hope you guys get inspired by this and want to create some clothing of your own. If so, I am so glad that I did my job correctly. And please, please, please send pictures to the Boys and Girls Club so we can see your creations. I hope you guys enjoyed this video on recycling and I can't wait to see you guys next time. Until then, this has been Miss Strawberry. Goodbye.